Good morning everyone. Today I'm going to talk about inflation. Inflation is a persistent increase in the general cost level of goods and service over a period of time. It impacts our purchasing power, savings, investments and the overall health of our economy. It is core inflation it is a double edged sword. Mild inflation can be a sign of growing economy, reflecting increased consumer spending and business activity. However, when inflation goes unchecked and spiral out of control, it can lead to detrimental consequences for individual and the economy as a whole. One of the most significant impact of inflation is it effect out on our purchasing power as price rise, the value of the money decreases, making it more expensive for us to buy goods and services. This decrease in purchasing power erodes the real value of our pensions and savings, potentially reducing our standard of living. Moreover, inflation can create uncertainty and instability in financial market. Investors may struggle to predict future price level, leading to market volatility and less confidence in making long-term investment. This can hinder economic growth and job creation. Further, complicating the challenge posed by inflation. The burden of inflation is not evenly distributed among all members of society. Low-income individuals and fixed-income earners, such as pensioners, are particularly vulnerable to its effect. Rising price can strain their budgets, making it harder to meet basic needs and maintain a decent quality of life. Central banks play a crucial role in managing inflation through monetary policy. By adjusting interest rate and controlling the money supply, they aim to keep inflation within a target range. Striking the right balance is challenging. As overly, tight policy may stifle economy growth, will lose policy and fuel in inflationary pressure. Future policy implemented by governments also have an impact on inflation. Res responsible fiscal measures such as prudent public spending and efficient taxation can help curb inflationary pressure. Additionally, st structural re reform to promote competition and productivity growth can contribute a stable price environment. In conclusion, inflation is an economic phenomenon that requires uh, our attention and understanding. As citizens, we must advocate the, for policies that, that strike a balance between economic growth and price stability. By holding our leader accountability and staying informed, we can collectively work towards a stable economy that benefits all members of society. Thank you.